And let's extend this a little bit more. I want you to look back down at your keyboard. And if there is some group of units that I'm controlling a lot, zero and nine are not really that good. Surprisingly, two through six are the easiest groups to control your units, not actually one. Again, look at one, how one A is, a, again, a little bit awkward to hit and how much easier it is to go four A. I just want you to compare those two, one A versus four A. I am absolutely not saying do not hotkey your units as one, because honestly, that's a very available hotkey for your, for your, uh, for your finger, your, your ring finger is generally right there. And the only reason that it's a little bit awkward is because 1A, attack move, uh, requires generally the same finger, or you have to do a little bit of finger bending to do that. Um, but I want to make you aware of what's easy for the hand. Because there's a, uh, I know of an extraordinarily good Terran player who has 1 as his scanner in Brood War, and then 2, 3, and 4, and 5 as his units. Now, I want you to just look at that hotkey setup, two, three, four, five on the keyboard, that's pretty easy to 2A, 3A, 4A, 5A. I can do that really easily with my um, <clears throat> my ring finger on the two, my pinky on the A, 2A, 3A, 4A, 5A. Um, and likewise, 2T, 3T, 4T for stim. Notice how easy that is for the fingers to do. That feels really natural, actually. And the one key, he actually doesn't use very much at all. So he puts a scan there. So that way he can easily control his medic marine and still scan whenever he needs to. Very clever. And I want to just make people aware of when you are thinking of your own hotkey setup. And I, I absolutely think that you should think of your own. I'm not going to prescribe one for you. But think of a nice hotkey setup for yourself. And then, and then once you have that, so you know what? I, I have five and six as my gateways. I have four as my nexus. I have three as a scout probe. That's the hockey setup I have. So I'm hitting three, three. And then I'm going to go five, Z, six, Z, four, E, three, three. Coming right back here. Three is actually my favorite button on the entire keyboard. I love pressing three. I just find it very, very nice for my hand. I, I'll... You know, if you watch any of my replays, I have one as my main units, three as another set of units, and I actually skip two a lot. <laughs> I just, I feel more comfortable with that, and I'm not, I don't think it's bad. I'm comfortable with it. I, I'm reasonably comfortable with the two hotkey as well. Uh, you know, if I have a lot of zealots, you know, if I have two sets of zealots, I happily control one for this top one and control two for this bottom one. I'll happily click them around like that. Um, but again, I like having three as my probe. Now, this is going to sound stupid. This is going to sound stupid. You're going to hear this and you're going to go, well, derp, yeah, yeah. you're going to do that. You're going to sound funny. But I guarantee you people screw this up a lot. Once you have established a set of hotkeys to use, use the friggin' hotkeys. Use them. Use your hotkeys. All right. Okay. So I'm going to come back here. I'm going to build a cybernetics core. I, I'm also going to be building assimilators. Notice how I'm shift pulling back everything. I want to build probes for E. Yes, I did it. Great. I want to build some zealots. Okay. 5Z, 6Z. I just tapped that. <laughs> I just tapped that. Uh, then 4E. I just hit 4E there. Now, something that I, I, I personally use quite a bit is I like to hotkey my constructing building, again, that important building, to zero. Because again, let's say I'm in a zealot micro battle. Now, I want you to look exclusively at this bottom portion of the screen, right where these two zealots portraits are. So here are my zealots. I'm setting them to control one. I'm microing. Oh, 4E. Oh, yeah, I'm microing. 5Z, oh, I'm microing, oh yeah, look at me, 6Z, continuing to micro, is that warp gate done? Zero, check the cybernetic score, come back here. And it might feel a little awkward to swing all the way up to the zero, but I actually think it's beneficial to have your hand be very accurate with that zero button, and to just be able to ping up there real fast, because then I can go zero, okay, G. All right, cool, 4E, 5Z, 6Z, and I'm going to get supply blocked. Oh no, I'm not, I guess my expo next is finished. Um, 
but it's so critical to use those hotkeys. Because again, let's say I'm in this battle and I check zero and I'm like, Jesus, warp gate's only at 20%. Oh my god, I want to be able to go zero, zero, four, C, chrono boost, one, one, come right back here. Oh, cool, I just used the hotkey setup that I created for myself, five, Z, six, Z, 4e oh one of chrono boost of probes 4 4 chrono boost 1 1 okay cool coming right back and now we're starting to feel like we're playing a musical instrument Ooh, yeah all right oh my god oh yeah zero zero four c okay cool and this is where people start to argue well jesus i sure do have to do a lot here this sure is giving me a lot of trouble you know like the idea of bouncing back like especially this zero zero four c one one business that seems really really obnoxious because when you have like players who get real fast they can bounce them back between screens and um i want to point out though that it's not that they're playing really fast it's that they do one action very 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 quickly so for instance i am going to wait oh no actually i have this guy so i'm gonna hotkey this nexus is four i'm gonna completely override the hotkey to this one um not nah, the hell of it let's just group them both together so i'm gonna hit five five four c and i'm gonna chrono boost just like that now i want you to note how slow everything i'm doing is click wait click wait click wait okay waiting 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 now i'm getting ready to do this i'm gonna hit, hit five five four c click five five four c click and then i'm right back again it looked like it happened fast but it was pretty simple motion that was going on so six z right i'm making a zealot out of my sixth thing pretty slow i'm intentionally clicking really slowly here i am making probes and for six six my gateway i want to come back six six four c great i have now chrono boosted that um and it's those little whippy motions that require a brief little do da boom you know a nice little little trill on the fingers but even then it's not like you must do it at that speed that's the thing that people seem to misunderstand because they see me um you know come over here and chrono boost and then whip back here and and they go oh my god day nine are you good you must be good and i'm like of course not i'm actually awful and of course uh, you know if you happily watch any of my tournament videos you get the chance to see that every now and again sometimes i pull through <laughs> but um what were we talking about? Oh yeah, but there's no reason, for instance, that you can't be in this in this battle. You know, you're you're coming around, you're microwing. You know, let's say uh, there's a mutiny and we have to kill some of our own zealots, and now I need to come back and I need to chrono boost five five um, five five, make a stalker, and then let's chrono boost. And let me actually do that all with my keyboard. Let me do all that with my keyboard. Here's my control six gateway. I'm gonna go six six four C click one one. Really only spent about half a second away from my army and was probably executing that at about 70 actions per minute. Not very fast at all. And I wanna just point out a meta note about what's been going on in this daily thus far. What you saw was me beginning without using this hand. I was actually just stroking my chin and musing. Mm, and perhaps adjusting my glasses because again bought them from costco they're not adjusted they're very cheap and of course they have snapped in half and once upon a time i will uh fix them but for now phew, coming back to this you saw me only use my mouse hand only use my mouse hand and all i talked about was the mental checklist i was not playing really fast at all but i was just remembering to do things and i was doing them and occasionally you saw little gentle um rises in the speed at which i did things but it was not ever motivated by me thinking oh, i want to click buttons fast oh it was motivated by me going huh i want to get this sort of thing done it's almost like if someone throws a frisbee and you run after it to try to catch it you have created a motivation for the running right you, and it's not that, oh yeah, you know, like, uh, well, I guess that's a, a bad example. Because I was about to say, yeah, it's almost like someone's saying you need to be in good shape to play Ultimate Frisbee. And you do. Um, but uh, just again, there, there, a lot of times you'll have a motivation for playing quickly. And that's the mental checklist. Just remembering, 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 remembering. I didn't talk about keyboard control. I didn't talk about mouse control. I didn't talk about any mechanics, really. I just talked about remember, 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 remember. Just keep telling yourself to do what needs to be done.
<sighs> and that was the most important part. And now I'm coming back to this hand thing, this keyboard thing, so that way we can sort of go, oh, how do I improve on my hand control a little bit? How do I come back here and perhaps run through my mental checklist faster? So, okay, cool. I'm noticing that I'm going to get supply blocked in 20 food, but let's say, oh my god, I'm going to get supply blocked. 4-4, four, four, build a probe. Oh, remembered my good habit to shift click back, and now I'm returning. Let's build another pylon. 4-4, four, four, building a pylon, coming right back. Perfect, great. And I have an idle worker here. All right, I'll build some pylons here. Yeah. Um, the keyboard, it serves your ability to do this mental checklist. And it's actually kind of funny because, you know, I'm sure many of you do this. I love LAN parties. I'm 23.